second ODI was dedicated to Archbishop Desmond Tutu in honor of his 75th birthday. The teams competed for the Strength in Diversity Trophy, named after the Desmond Tutu Diversity Trust, and the South Africans gave him the best possible birthday present at Sahara Park Newlands with a 196-run win over Australia. Good shot, really good shot, and has beaten the field too. Straight down the ground again and beats the fieldsman. Three fours in that area. Two from the right-hander, one from the left-hander. They are peppering the straight boundary. Short one, first short one, four. Oh, he's hit that like a rocket. He's lent into that one. It's gone flying off his bat for four at backward point. Well, they really are taking the Aussies to the cleaners and the crowd are loving every moment of it. 40 without loss. It's got him, bowled him. The perfect line and length. Graham Smith departs, Herschel Gibbs enters. 182 won international games now, an average of 35. That's away. Porta de Pena and South Africa needed that to just break the shackles a little bit. He's edged it on. Watson has struck in his first over. It's a great opportunity here for Australia. The other batsman that's been in for a while, he's out. And it's very much leaves South Africa right now with two new batsmen at the crease. It's 57 for two. David Villiers, the next man striding the crease for South Africa. Through the covers, open the face and a run away for four. And that's down the ground. He's got some beautiful timing on that. Oh, take that, Shane Watson. And a bit of that. Beautiful shot. Beautiful, beautiful stroke. It's a poor stroke. South Africa lose their third. 95 for three. Halfway through the 22nd over, the third wicket has just gone down. <laughs> Slap that away, back of the square on the offside for four. That's a good shot. That's way in the air. That's way over the top. That's into the crowd. Gone just when he should have been consolidating. Herschel Gibbs has gone and got himself out. Big wicket, I reckon, for Australia. 175 for four. And Justin Kemp is the new batsman, an average of 32. Down the track. Wow, that is a good shot. That is a beauty. It's even got a bit of a fade on it. Have a look at this decision pitch pitched on line. Long way forward, but probably would have hit the stumps. One ball away from completing the 39th over. Sean Pollock it is, who is uh, striding out to the middle. Good shot. Pollock oh, sweeping. Is he going to get there? He'll have to get the dive in, and he just gets the ball caught up in his fingers. There we go, over the mid-wicket. Has it gone all the way? Yes, it has. This is a huge over for South Africa. 22 from it, 240 for five. Oh, what a sweet hit. What a sweet hit. That's over the top as well. If you get it wrong, you go for six. Up in the air and we'll be out, or should be. Not a bad delivery to bowl. He's gone wider on the crease, which means he's trying to fire it in at the batsman, make sure that he doesn't have room to swing the arms. I think he wanted to go over mid-wicket and 
Just managed to pop it up straight in the air. He's gone for 38. 254 for six. Robert Peterson comes in with just three and a bit overs to go. Straight to back. Good point there. Claiming a catch here. Peterson realises now he's got to walk off. Robbie Peterson now looking at the bottom of his bat, uh, whatever the, the outcome of what he thinks, he's gone for four. 262 for seven. There's a bit more loop on the ball than there was in normal motion. It seemed to go from front to Now you and I have watched a lot of cricket and normally you can pick it straight away, but that's not one of them. That's a huge hit. He's hit that. Let me tell you, he's hit that. Goodness me. He's got it wide up uh, mid-wicket, and it will run away for four. Kemp goes to 51. His seventh 50 in one-day international cricket, and his first against Australia. 51 in 41 deliveries, and he's set a total of 290, or assisted in setting a total of 290 for Australia to score. Smith starting things off, 24 of 29, 31 of 43 for Dippinard and Gibbs, and De Villiers also getting runs. Voucher involved in a partnership with Gibbs, 42 and 66 for those two guys. from the, the man with the buckets there. Oh, he goes for naught. It's one for two. So, Damien Martin now to the crease. for four, it's five for three. Michael Clark. Oh, is it? Yes, it is. Michael Clark comes to the wicket. That's out, he's got behind, that's a huge thing. Short outside off stump, short dish outside off stump, going for the big booming drive on the up stump. Have another look at it. Well, he's ripped the heart out of this top order. Would you believe it? Australia seven for four. So uh, seven for four at the moment. South Africa uh, made 289 for seven, and uh, the Australians. Well, Katic has watched all this happening. He's faced 22 balls. He hasn't got a run yet. into his third over and he's also joined the party. The Australian woes continue. Yes, I get a situation where he realised he had to do something, Kadic, and uh, try and 
turn this game around and get some momentum going, but not to be. And the dejected Michael Kadic makes his way to the pavilion as well. He goes for 16 or 48 balls, 33 for five. That's a good shot, straight down the ground. Great captaincy by Smith. 57 for six. So Brad Hogg is the new batsman. He's always uh, chirpy, a bit of a smile on his face, typical sort of wrist spinner, I suppose. And um, slightly over pitched that one straight away. And it's gone for four. Well, he's had a go at that one. It's going to go just. No, he's catching. said not out. Hot gone, 70 for 7. Oh, that's going down to third man. Here's another catch. There you go. Back down. Never finish the sentence. Well, I was hoping you would, uh, Robin. You want to roll there. Australia now 71, you'd ever believe it, for eight. Nathan Bracken, strike rate of 100. He left arm out of it. Australia, uh, you can only say, oh, very good batting conditions. And 96 for nine. I'm sure they can't believe the luck either. Watson's now decided to play a few shots. Hey, there it is. That's all six. That's six. That's six. Done and dusted. And man of the match. The best figures ever for a South African bowler in one day internationals. Australia all out for 93 in pursuit of 290 as the target to win the game. Got nowhere close. Fantastic work today in the evening by Makai Antini. Sean Pollock did his bit, didn't get wickets, but also Andre Nell getting three wickets.